Hey, thanks for coming back. Today I'd like to talk to you about this. This is the Ugreen 4-in-1 card reader. It's USB 3.0, but it's also backwards compatible with the earlier versions of USB. USB 1, 1 1.1, and 2.0. It works with Windows XP all the way through Windows 10, to Mac OS, Linux, and Chrome. And it's plug and play meaning there's nothing to download or install. You just plug it in and you're done. The cable length is one and a half feet long or if my math is right, 45 centimeters. Now this takes actually four different types of memory cards. It takes compact flash, MS uh, memory stick, better known as the Sony memory stick. I think they're really the only ones who used it micro SD and full size SD. Right here is the compact flash slot with the MS slot right there. And on this side, you got your both SD and micro SD slot on that side. Now, with the, when it comes to the SD and micro SD cards, you can use up to 512 gigabyte capacity cards, okay? And the transfer rates you get with this is up to five gigabytes now that depends upon a lot if you're using a usb 3.0 port believe it or not your actual system and the type of card you're using will determine your transfer speeds so keep all of that in mind now the reason why i got this one yeah it was kind of cheap i'm going to admit it but two, because my original or my very first digital camera was a Kodak camera. And if I remember correctly, the model number was the DC-10. And it took compact flash cards just like this. And I wanted to be able to have or pull those pictures off, not just to put them on my computer, but maybe switch them over to an SD card or micro SD card to keep for, you know, prosperity for future usage. So not only can I do that, but I bought this. This is an adapter for a full-size SD card. Right here in this little black part here, I can stick a full-size SD card in here and use it in the compact flash slot. Now, when it comes to the MS memory card or the Sony memory card, they make an adapter for that too. But this one takes micro SD. And there's the micro SD card right here. So in a way, this card reader can take two full-size SD cards and two micro SD cards. The other thing I like about this card reader is I can put in all the cards. Now I'm not going to be able to do it quick because I'm videoing, but let's just take these two. As you can see, there's the compact flash one and there's the other one here. With a simple click and hold and release of the mouse, I can transfer files from this one to that one that quick and simple. I don't have to pull it off the compact flash card, put it onto my hard drive, and then from my hard drive up to the MS card. I don't have to do that. I can just simply swap from drive G to drive F, just like that, and I'm done. So, do I recommend you get this reader, this card reader? Yeah, it's not going to be necessarily for everyone, but if you want, if you don't mind getting some ad extra adapters, which were fairly cheap, so you can use two micro SD cards and two full size SD cards, then yeah, it's definitely worth getting. It's really budget friendly. I've been using this for quite a long time now, probably about a good month and a half already, and I have never had any problems with this card reader. So yeah, I would highly recommend getting one. 
Yes, I know I can buy a single USB card reader for the compact flash card, but why should I add one more little gadget when I can just use this? This eliminates that. Me buying, you know, buying that. So it's this is all in one. I don't have to go through my drawers, dig out each all this stuff to plug into my computer and this is much easier. That's why I got it. So yeah, I would highly recommend it. Coming up is the test video. Um, I'm not going to speak on it at all. So you're in luck on that one. It's your lucky day. Play the lottery. Not going to talk on the test video. But what it's really going to do is it's just me doing a screen record of my laptop. I plug in the reader and then I slowly plug in each card, memory card, and you'll see the drive letters pop up. Then I kind of go down to the corner and show you how to, you can eject each one if you'd like. And that's pretty much it. So, there you go. It's a good card reader and I would highly recommend it. Here's the test video. Hopefully you enjoyed this video, and if you did, please give it that thumbs up. If you haven't done so, please subscribe to my channel, and please don't forget about the notification bell either. It would really help me out a lot and mean a lot to me if you were to share this video and maybe some of my other videos on all of your social media sites. And until the next video, you, your friends, your family, and all of your pets, have a great day.